Uh, we didn't get any eggs. Yeah, we did. Well, we got one egg. But this might be the better thing. Jakey, hold on, hon. Thank you, Kelly. Uh, Jake. Excuse me. Uh, uh, you like the Easter Bunny? That was a good one. On an Easter egg hunt. And we're going to find some eggs. Hey, buddy, man. <laughs> This will be the moment when Cindy decides to walk. Yeah. The eggs. Hey, Jake, why don't you let Sid find some? Okay. This one, Mom. Okay, why, well, why don't you go show that to Sid? You're so close. Oh, good job. Is it for Sid? Sid. Hello, sweetheart. Hi. Who's that? Is that Mommy? Is that Mommy? Let's go on to Come here. <laughs> Hello, sweetheart. You want to take over, Daddy? Everybody knows the story of the three little pigs, or at least they think they do. But I'll let you on, in on a little secret. Nobody's ever heard the real story because nobody's ever heard my side of the story. Go ahead. Introduce yourself. So come on out, piggies. Hey, it's not my fault. Wolves eat cute little animals like bunnies, sheep, and pigs. That's just the way we are. If cheeseburgers were cute, folks would think you were big and bad, too. Everybody, this is the real story. This is the real story. <laughs> 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 we still didn't have a cup of sugar for my dear old granny's birthday cake. <laughs> now these two pigs were a little bit smarter, but not much. They had built their house out of sticks. So I went to the door and I rang the doorbell. Ding dong. No answer. So I called. Little pig, little pig, are you in? And you know what they said? Go away, she can't come in. We're shaving the hairs on our chinny chin chin. We're shaving the hairs on our chinny chin chin. And just then, I felt my cold coming on again. So I huffed, and I snuffed, and I sneezed a great sneeze. Heck, chomp! And you're not going to believe it, but these guys' house fell down too, just like their sisters. In the middle were the first and second little pigs. They've been home the whole time. Poke them. But my cold got out of his reporters. And they asked the wolf all these questions. Come on out, Mr. Wolf, Mr. Wolf. Go ahead, girls. Mr. Wolf, Mr. Wolf, why did you do it? Go ahead, girls. Can we get a shot of you smiling with your fangs? Can I take a picture of you, Mr. Wolf? Well, the news reporters found out about the pigs, and they figured a sick guy going to borrow a cup of sugar didn't sound very exciting. So they jazzed up the story a little bit, and they made him the big bad wolf. Granny, come on out. Say, stay away from my granddaughter. Hugger, hugger, hugger. Oh. Cops, I've heard enough. I've heard enough. Book them, Dano. Book them, Dano. <laughs> Oh, 
awesome. Give it to Nanny for this. Do